the Election Commission of India has released the official overall turnout data for the completed phases 1 and 2 on Tuesday. The development comes 11 days after the first phase concluded on April 19th and four days after the second phase ended on April 26th. The poll body's data reveals that the voter turnout in the first phase was recorded at 66.14% across 102 constituencies as compared to 69.43% in 2019. Meanwhile, in the second phase, it slightly increased to 66.71% as compared to the first phase. However, the second phase polling numbers across 88 parliamentary constituencies were 3.3 percentage points down from 2019. Talking of male and female voters, the official data indicates that in the first phase, the voter turnout in India was 66.22% for males, 66.7% for females and 31.32% for third gender voters, resulting in an overall turnout of 66.14%. In the second phase, the turnout was 66.99% for males, 66.42% for females and 23.86% for third gender voters with an overall turnout of 66.71%. Bihar recorded the lowest voter turnout of 49.26% in the first phase while Uttar Pradesh recorded the lowest turnout at 55.19% in the second phase. Interestingly, 11 out of the 21 states and union territories that went to polls in the first phase recorded a higher turnout of women voters, whereas in the second phase, 6 out of the 12 states and a union territory that went to polls recorded a higher turnout of women voters. Explaining the delay in announcing the official data, ECI underlined that it could only be released after counting the postal ballots and adding them to the total EVM vote count. Meanwhile, multiple opposition leaders are questioning the poll body over not releasing the actual voter numbers from each constituency. One such example is Congress General Secretary in Charge of Communications, Jay Ram Ramesh, who questioned the delay in a post on social media platform X. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.